There. Maybe I'm ready now. I'm Wendy from Bridgeport, Connecticut. I'm 49 years old. I am single, I have no children, and I haven't cut my hair in eight and a half years. My hair is so long, I've grown it out three times and I've donated it. Ugh, these ends are so dry. It does get a little bit difficult to take care of, especially on these humid days. I wear it up, I'll braid it, I'll bun it. When my hair is this long though, sometimes it gets stuck in things. It gets stuck in people's glasses and people's jewelry. Sometimes I close a door on it. <laughs> I've always loved my long hair, but now that I'm about to turn 50, I think it's time for a change. I would describe my style as bohemian. I like flowy skirts and dresses and colors and patterns and florals. The world should have more color in it. I always shop on clearance. I never get anything full price, either clearance or the thrift store. <laughs> and maybe I should grow out of that at some time. I don't know, but it works for me. I absolutely love my job at the library and I wish it were full time, but it's just part time. So I've been interviewing for more full time work and I think that a fresh new look would give me more confidence and maybe it'll be the same with going on dates. People know me by my hair. So all of that is really scary to think is just gonna change, but life has changed. My mom passed away when she was 50. In turning 50, it's, I think, much more meaningful for me than it would have been if she had been around. In her honor, I wanna just really live my life to the fullest and be the best me I can be. When we first started the show, I'm like, everybody does makeovers, let's not do makeovers. And then we started doing them and we put a weird twist on all of them. And I'm like, oh my God, I love these! And I love so them. Yeah, yeah, they were so fun. So we're gonna make the first cut. Absolutely. Here, so I'm you gonna can turn hold you my hand. This way, Wendy. Are you, are you freaked you. out by cutting off a lot of hair? Oh my gosh, I, I am. I've been known by my for my hair forever. So I am a little bit, but I'm, I'm really ready. You're ready. I'm, I'm I, ready I now. sense this. Hey, don't forget Ooh, this part. Thanks, I didn't see that part. <laughs> I'm like, don't leave her with that one little tail. And you know, I think that when yeah. you have hair this long and you're gonna cut it all off, I think it's important to think about where you're gonna donate it. I was gonna say, yeah, you, know? you should cut off enough to donate yeah. it. If, you, if, you, if you're gonna make a change, you might as well make a change in other people's lives too. This will be the fourth time that I've donated my hair. It's the fourth time she's donated her hair, bless her. <laughs> Good job. All right, first cut. <laughs> Already it looks amazing. Uh, <laughs> <laughs> Come on out, Wendy! <laughs> Wendy! 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 <laughs> Wendy! <laughs> Wendy, turn around and look at your hair. When do <laughs> what? Oh what? Uh, what? Right, Rachel? Oh my God, Jason! <laughs> Look at that color. It's good. And Listen, this is what we're doing. Oh my God! So okay. much fun. Oh, well, you know, Jason, wow. his inspiration. Wendy, how kind of... do you feel? <laughs> don't cry. You look amazing. <laughs> I honestly. I don't recognize myself. I it's feel amazing. like such a oh different person. I feel so free and light and. <laughs> <laughs>